Hey everyone, it's Stacey Nicole here with Session of Scraps, and I am back with another Project Life kit. Um, first off, I just want to apologize for all the fan noise. It is hot here today, and we have an air quality alert, and with my asthma, I have to have the fans running. I think I have like six fans, six, seven fans running into the house. I haven't had to turn the air on yet, but I have a feeling it's going to be happening soon. Um, kind of going back to the old school of way of organizing my kits. The newer way was not working for me, and I'll show you why. I love this Iris container. It's got a couple issues, and the main issue is, well, first off, these don't ever want to stay. Secondly, they don't go all the way down. Like, the, this one was built in, and you can see it's flush against the bottom there. The ones that you stick in the little slots do not go all the way down. Um, so you have issues of them getting all mixed up and the organizationalist OCD in me <laughs> does not like that. Not only that, I don't like, um, I'm having issues with my hands because my hands swell up from my arthritis. Trying to get smaller pieces and you know, some little pieces like this. Trying to get those out of there, it's just, it's just a bit of a pain and it's just not working. So. Back to the old way we go. <laughs> we'll give this a try. I bought a shelf today for my desk um, to help organize my Project Life kit. It was too big. I give up. I've tried everything to organize my Project Life kits. It just don't work. This doesn't work. So anyway, onto the kit itself. Um, this kit is based on the Simple Stories Life in Color collection. This came out about two years ago and I'm still in love with it. Absolutely in love with colors. Uh, normally, I would never mix most of these colors, but it just works so well for the collection. So, it's got um, some like tealish, turquoise, black, yellow, red, as well as a very light plush pink. And it does have like a corally peachy orange as well. So, that's cool. And then to go with that, where did I put it? Um, I got the 12 by 12 paper pad in my last haul. And so I went ahead and went through and took out all the cut apart sheets and thought I would try to cut those apart and get those used up. Um, some of them I might use for embellishments, like totally these. I could totally see, see these cutting apart and using them for journaling. Um, I'm not sure if I'll keep that hole or not. Um, but definitely really cute um, cards in here. Love that camera. So adorable. Love those. And there's that one. So there's that. Okie dokie. As for Project Life cards, I didn't pull a ton. Um, these, This is from, I think, is it Little Things? Little Things? Something like that. Little Things, Little Moments Project Life Core Kit. I apologize. I don't have it next to me. It didn't have a lot of the colors, so I went ahead and got that tealish turquoise, as well as this um, corally kind of red color. And then from the Wanderer collection, I pulled a few cards. It did have the grays, it did have the teals. It didn't really have, um, it has like this more of a berry, berry gray kind of color, so I don't know how that's gonna work. I did pull in some navies to add another color to my kit. And then as always, I go through my scraps and pull a good little chunk trying to get scraps used. I have way, way, way too many scraps. And I don't know if like, I I don't know about you guys, but I cannot throw my scraps away. It's just such a waste of money. And so I'm hoping, <laughs> I'm hoping that maybe one day I'll find somebody that'll take all my scraps for me. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I'm hoping one day I can get through them or something. I don't know. So another collection that I am adding to this is this really cute Echo Park um cat collection i don't know if you can tell here but it does have the reds and it does have a yellow it's a little bit different yellow kind of has this bluish color that which is in the collection too if you can see that there so it works it works and it does have the tealer collar too tealer tealer that makes a lot of sense stacy tealish collar as well so I wanted to add that and I just couldn't wait to use it because I love my cat and I have tons of pictures of them. And then I pulled, I went ahead and put in the 12 by 12 papers that I got for that as well. The cut apart and then these two cute um, 
12 by 12 papers. I thought I will cut those up, put them down, whatnot. So there is that. Let me get that out of the way. Grab my other caddy to put my stickers in. And then I have some enamel dots, of course. Of course I have enamel dots, sorry. Let me get my big arm out of the way. Um, I pulled these really pretty pink kind of plush cotton candy-ish Bella Boulevard ones. These old Teresa Collins ones, maybe I can get those used up. And then from Simple Stories, I got the Emoji Love and the um, Love Adore ones. This is more of the yellow in the collection. Um, this is more of the red. So it kind of works. There's a little bit of each color. There is that blue color in the collection as well as um, the living color. Live in color? Life in color. Hello. Life in color collection. Hello. Yeah, see? I'm getting it. And then I just grabbed a couple different alphas. Fun, exciting stuff there. Not really, but we'll pretend. And then um, I also did grab the Take Note collection because it did have the light blues. It kind of had that corally plush pink as well as some yellows and some reds. And it also has that navy blue color that I'm bringing in again. Don't mind that. That's where I put my scraps. So there is a look at that. So I think I can maybe get some of that used. And let me throw that in there. So all guys, good stuff. So from that collection, I have the stamp set. I did not use my stamp set in my last um, kit. Really disappointed in myself because I am obsessed with buying Project Life stamps. I don't have a ton, but when I can get them cheap, I buy them. So hopefully I will get this used up. So um, this is the Fancy Pants Take Note Ephemera Pack. Let's open it up and see what we got here. All kinds of good stuff. Goodness gracious. Just tons of tidbits going everywhere. And I don't know about you guys, but I keep my packaging because I can definitely use that for a 3x4 card. So, woohoo! Like I said, I try not to let anything go to waste. Okie dokie. Look at all this fun stuff. So again, it's got the reds and the blues. And it does have this yellow color. It's kind of like a yellow-green. Like a, almost a pea color. I don't know. Love those books. Those are so cute. All kinds of stuff. I don't know if you... I love tabs. I can never get enough tabs. Bookworm. That's cute. So don't know how much of this I will get used. There's some things I definitely can see using. Some of it I honestly don't see myself using. But I'll go through it later when I'm done with my kit. And weed it out. So there is all of that. Goodness gracious. We got little thumbtacks and everything in there. Okay. All right. More fun stuff. Um, I have these Simple Stories Life Documented. Again, it's got the navy blue. It's got the yellow. It does have a brighter bit of pink color. And the turquoise-ish blue isn't the really same, but I think it could go. I think it could work. We'll make it work. Let me put those over there. And then I pulled these um, Ali Studio uh, labels, cut aparts. Lots of different fun colors in there. And I'll cut up those later. And then um, from Studio Calico, these journaling cards. They have been in my stash for a while and I have not used them. So hopefully we'll get that used up. And again, more packaging I can cut up later. And it does have that uh, turquoise bluish color. Tealish, turquoise, teal, whatever you want to call it. And it does have reds in there. So I definitely think I can get these used up. So there is that. And then I pulled these um, uh, Me and My Big Idea Mambi stickers. They are the vacation stickers. And I pulled them because obviously it's black and white. But it does have the reds and it does have some blues in there as well. They're really cute. So there's those. And I got some washi tape. And last but not least, some ephemera from my stash. So hopefully this gets me motivated to get something created. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe.